Hi, I'm Liam from Fowles and welcome to this week's Home Renovator Auction Preview. Now, uh, we've still got the lockdown, so unfortunately you can't come and check out the goods in person, but they are all available online as in previous weeks, so it's a similar sort of setup. Uh, last call for bids will be uh, Wednesday the 6th of October at 10am, so that will be the la when, the, when the bids actually close. Now, you can look online and you'll see uh, every single item has a photo and a form you can fill out to place your absentee bids. Have a look at all this stuff, folks. It's just come in. Uh, X display, washed oak, French provincial, uh, bedroom furniture primarily, uh, all kinds of bits and pieces. Uh, absolutely beautiful. I'm thinking money-wise, it's pretty tidy. Uh, there's a couple of bits with uh, some chips. There'll be notes in the catalogue. You'll see that uh, when you look online. Uh, I'm reckoning sort of between mostly 100 and sort of 300 bucks would be about the right money. Maybe a little more for the really big pieces, the really big tidy pieces. But it's absolutely beautiful, so uh, make sure you don't miss out on any of that stuff from there. There's these beautiful uh, bedside drawers there, so I think there's pretty well matching sets most of the way through. Um, so yeah, really nice gear. What else can I show you? Uh, these have also just come in. We've got some, uh, some Technica freestanding cookers. Uh, there are a couple of dings on them. They are sort of uh, scratch and dents. You can see some bits and pieces here. So, uh, look, they'll be a, bit, a little bit cheaper than probably what you expect just because of that. So, uh, if you're not fussed with that, or maybe it's a, a, going, a landlord going into a rental, perhaps, uh, you're probably looking, I reckon, sort of starting bidding of about that $500 mark. There will be three months warranty on those. Uh, so, really nice looking gear. A uh, couple of wood-fired heaters still available. Uh, not a great deal, it's just what's probably left from last week, but there's some pretty nice gear. Uh, there's a built-in one there, lot 110, the Calora. Uh, nice big unit, that one. Uh, and then there's also a, a, a sort of a medium size in the Warm Bright 200, also built-in, lot 111. Then we've got the baby ones. I think we've got one or two of these baby ones, uh, and they're good little bargains as well. So uh, there's one there. We've got, also got the cooking, um, the, 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 the heat and cook so you've got the oven underneath they're pretty fantastic uh, another warm bright 200 the built-in unit so there's quite a few built-in units available um, and same sort of story as the, the weeks previous with the previous deliveries uh, probably around sort of for something like this the, the, the small ones I'm guessing sort of about that $600 mark would be about right maybe a little more and then up around the $1,000 mark for those uh, those beautiful built-in ones and also the heat and cooks uh, so yeah plenty plenty there uh, all with three months factory warranty as well well we're coming into outdoor kitchen weather folks as you can probably feel uh, there's a nice double uh, door fridge there out of beef eater and also this beautiful big uh, outdoor kitchen we've still got a few of these I think they actually sent some more uh, you've got it comes flat packed so we can deliver it out to you really easily uh, with the stone tops with the outdoor um, the outdoor cupboards and also the the, the, um, the tap and the sink uh, beautiful looking units the bidding's been around that three and a half and they've been going through no problems lots of French door fridges uh, we sold a mountain of fridges last week but a few more delivered this week uh, really nice looking gear there there's uh, lot 127 through to lot 131 so check those out. Uh, plenty of Frankie sinks in as well. With the Frankie sinks you're probably looking around a half to a third of normal retail, uh, so they'll be pretty good fun as well. Uh, I've got some uh, some entrance lever key sets and some keyed sets, so lots of door furniture there, and I'm from memory around, they've been bidding around that sort of 10 to $20 mark, just depending on the features of each one. Some nice appliances here delivered. Uh, one thing I did notice, lot 549, that's uh, something we don't get every day, uh, not even every year, that's a LP gas double oven. Uh, so it's a really nice looking unit there, and if, uh, if you're on bottle gas, so you might be down the beach or in the country, uh, they come up very, very really if ever. Uh, 12 months factory warranty, Westinghouse branded. You couldn't ask for better than that if you need an LP gas oven. Lots of dishwashers still as well, lots of Westinghouse ones, so just file through the catalogue and have a look and see uh, what suits you there. Uh, around the corner there we've got plenty of these top load washing machines, still 10 and 11 kilo top load washing machines, one, two, three, four, five, six of those there, uh, and more beautiful French door fridge over the other side as well. Gecko's going to just film down there for you. There we go. So some really nice looking fridges here. If you can't find something here, there's something wrong there. Absolutely sensational, all of those fridges. Another nice double oven there, the, uh, the Electrolux this time, top brand there uh, with the pyrolytic cleaning. Uh, over on this table, we've got some beautiful looking uh, higher end 
uh, vanities, wall mount vanities. I reckon they're going to sort of go for that sort of four or five hundred dollar mark. So they're pretty nice. Uh, this one in particular, I really like this one with the stone top, double vanity. Uh, looks like it's an ex showroom display, I'd say, uh, but that's a really nice looking unit there. Uh, one another one I really want to draw your attention to. This is lot 181. It's been in it for a few weeks. It's unreserved. It's a feather couch, so it's feather cushions. It is so comfortable, folks. One dollar, no reserve. It's pretty tidy, it's pretty good looking, and it is 10 out of 10 comfort. So if you're looking for a couch, uh, if you're locked down and you're in front of the telly and your couch is, isn't comfortable enough, one dollar, no reserve on that one. Feather filled couch, absolute ripper. Okay, moving through now, we have got, I just want to sh quickly show you, there's another beautiful vanity there. Uh, that's a lush vanity floor mount, uh, 1,500 uh, wide. I reckon probably about that five or $600 mark, but it's absolutely beautiful. Stone top, uh, beautiful two-pack finish front, uh, really nice unit, lot 182. Uh, the other thing is we're getting to the end of the air conditioners now, uh, so make sure if you haven't got one that you organise to get some. The uh, th two, the 3.2s are sold out now. We're down to the 2.5s in the Scandia uh, Adena, uh, so there's a few of those left. Uh, beautiful units there, uh, all packed up really beautifully and ready to go. Uh, around that $415 mark has been the right number to bid there. There are some, in the larger sizes, some Dimplex, lot 184, only a couple there, uh, and you're looking about that sort of high $300 mark with those. So with warranties, they're absolutely beautiful and they'll nearly run out. I reckon by the time we get to a 30 degree day, they'll all be gone. Uh, got quite a few of these too. It looks like six of these. It's the Forge uh, 01000 wood storage, about $600 in the shops. Winning bids last week were around $265. So I expect the same sort of thing again. Uh, if you are doing an outdoor kitchen, these are absolutely sensational. The Signature Pro line range hood for the outdoors. Uh, Beef Eater branded, of course. I'm reckoning about $1,400 will get the, get the business there. Nearly 2,500 cubic metres an hour uh, is, the, uh, is the extraction rate. So really fantastic. Absolutely perfect for an outdoor kitchen. Still got a few of these left. The gas heat, the, uh, the gas log fires uh, out of Scandia again. Really nice looking units uh, with a warranty. They run on natural gas, but it does come with an LP conversion kit. So you could pick up the double oven back there and one of these and run it on the bottle if you wanted to. About $1,400 on those. A little bit of kitchen gear here. There's a pretty nice sink there with all the accessories. I reckon probably about oh, 150, 200 bucks there for that sink. Uh, and also there's a nice looking uh, range hood there. I'm guessing it's, look, it's a glass, uh, Technica glass range hood, three month warranty, pretty tidy. I'm guessing sort of 100 to 150 dollars on that. Walking through here, mountains of fridges. Actually, there was a couple of fridges I wanted to show you while we're on this lane. So I'll just double back for a tick. Um, you might have seen the last video. We've just about sold all of these beautiful Electrolux uh, French door fridges with the drawers underneath. Uh, I've got these two here. Now, uh, lot number 540, little little scratch there, little nick. It is a scratch and dent, of course, but a little nick there. And then on the other one, I saw uh, 541, a little ding, ding on the bottom of the, the bottom drawer. Uh, so they will be a little bit cheaper, but they will still they'll sell because it's, it's absolutely nothing compared to what you're going to pay for them. Last ones were going for that sort of two thousand dollar mark a couple of hundred bucks off these ones and they'll be gone absolutely no problems still got a couple of these as well the uh, the KitchenAid fridges obviously they are sensational units uh, and around that just shy of four thousand the winning bids were last week so uh, really nice units more fridges loads of fridges just have a bit of a rifle through the, the website and uh, have a look at all the different ones that are available there pretty nice units uh, loads of them as you can see um, got a couple of these uh, fireplace hearths uh, there's uh, probably a good half dozen of those and they're around that hundred dollar mark But it does save you doing all the tiling if you're putting in one of the uh, the wood-fired heaters uh, Nice appliances here. I can see some pull-out range hoods on the end uh, They generally go for sort of 50 to 100 bucks usually uh, Loads of ovens come in as well beautiful looking ovens all different styles You'll be able to uh, look online and perhaps Google the model numbers see what you're up for in the shops And then uh, maybe aim for sort of a third of the retail money on those so uh, that's probably the best way to, to work, work out uh, what, you, what your bid's going to be. Lots of Frankie taps, heaps and heaps of Frankie taps, and again, a half to a third to a half of retail is what they usually go out for. Lots of different bathroom furniture here from uh, mixer taps, shower mixers, basin mixers, uh, some shelves as well. 
more Frankie kitchen taps through here, so loads and loads of kitchen taps. You'll be there for hours having a look through all, through them all. It's great fun, of course, checking it all out and putting your bids in. Uh, down the bottom here, Frankie sinks. There's some nice-looking Frankie sinks there. All the dimensions and everything should be there. Uh, if not, again, just Google the model number, and that'll give you a good idea of, uh, of what you're looking at. Uh, all these beautiful ovens through here. I usually show the uh, Asatos. I've got, still got plenty of these two Asatos. Uh, lots 269 and 270. Around that 250 dollar mark gets those away usually so they're pretty nice uh, there's a nice little euro made built-in microwave there with convection so that's a nice one there for the size uh, a couple of range hoods up the top here i reckon you're probably going to be about that 100 150 dollar mark on those so that's good buying as well still got way more uh, appliances down the back here so uh, right through here i can see as well we've got some uh, nice little uh, bits for the bathroom some some vanity above counter vanity bowls uh, a couple more range hoods in here they're pretty look, good looking units there again around that 100 to 150 dollar mark so uh, pretty nice looking looking stuff there uh, what have we got down this lane we've got um, more vanities loads of vanities by the looks uh, we've got some single wall hung units there i reckon they'll be sort of around that 150 mark would be about my guess there a uh, nice little, fr is that a freezer? Fridge, upright fridge it is. Upright fridge, I'm going to guess uh, probably 150 on that will be about the right money, maybe a little bit more. Uh, loads of sinks again, so we've got heaps and heaps of sinks in this week. Uh, so you can see all through there, uh, some really nice looking gear, probably around that 100 to $150 mark we'll get the money, get, get the bid on those ones. What else can I show you down this way? These caught my eye. We've still got a few of these. Uh, is the uh, the French uh, black radiant heaters. Uh, it looks like there's four or five of those. Nice looking units. Uh, memory, the bidding was about that mid $200 mark. Uh, but there are a good couple of thousand in the shops. So uh, make sure you check those out as well. Uh, lots of ovens still to go through here. Uh, and up to my right ovens. And also down on to my left. I just want to show you these as well. More wall mounted vanities. About that $300 mark. I mean, if you're in the in the real shops, uh, you'd see these in the real shops for a thousand or more, maybe $1,200. So they're nice and solid, really good looking units. I can see some more range hoods through here. Gosh, if you need a range hood this week, uh, plenty of, and I reckon around that $100 mark would be the go. Uh, lots of compact ovens. We've got microwaves, uh, steam ovens, uh, standard compact ovens. There's a nice looking Bertazzoni oven there. That'll be a couple of thousand dollars in the shops. I reckon that'll go for a couple of hundred dollars. Uh, what else have we got? More compact ovens. Uh, we've got, uh, still got some of this mirror furniture as well. Uh, down through here so if you've seen see anything you like put an offer in uh, I reckon you'll go all right on these so there's probably a good 20 uh, bits of mirrored furniture I want to show you these couches too I've got a two and three seater set so it's a nice looking set lot 443 I reckon it looks it's it's absolutely spotless and very comfortable I reckon you'll be about a thousand dollars would be the would be a winning bid on there uh, and then across the way uh, is a nice big three and a half seater unit I'm guessing about sort of 500 bid 450 you 500 bucks, you'll be fine, you'll get it, no worries, I reckon. Uh, moving through now, uh, still got some dryers here from Electrolux, they're pretty nice. Only a couple left now, there's uh, the six kilo vented dryers with a three month warranty, they're really good. I've got one of those, they're fantastic. Uh, this looks like it's a freezer as well. Um, what have we got here down here? This one, the Euro made uh, dishwasher. Uh, I reckon probably around a couple of hundred dollars there. So there's a, a, a stainless and a white Euro made dishwasher. So still got a few dishwashers left. We went through a mountain of dishwashers last week, uh, but there's still a few around. So uh, that's good to see as well. Another one of those beautiful dark stainless steel double ovens there out of Electrolux, uh, lot 476. Nice looking unit there. A uh, couple of these fridges here, there's a scratch and dent, there's a, they're, they're extra display, so they've got a few dings on them, but uh, I reckon you're probably going to be looking about 150, 200 bucks for those. Uh, so this, they're perfectly tidy inside, it's got a few dings on the outside, and uh, wouldn't be a bad beer fridge, or you can put some fridge magnets over there, uh, still got a warranty to operate correctly, so bid with confidence on those. Uh, on this table I can see a few nice range hoods here, and some more compact ovens, so uh, lots of compact ovens in this week. Uh, Pretty nice looking units. What else can I show you? Uh, down the back here, 900 free standards. There's a couple of 900 free standards. Actually, I'm going to go this lane. I can see a few things in this lane that are pretty nice. Uh, I've got uh, a couple of, uh, there's a 540 mil uh, gas 
uh, gas oven there and a 600 or 2540 so really good for the landlords if you're replacing a 540 mil I reckon sort of 250 300 bucks I'll get those uh, that's a nice one as well that's a euro made uh, 900 freestander with gas top electric inside uh, and you're going to be around that thousand dollar mark so that's a nice looking unit there lots of dishwashers through here uh, across the way let's have a look I'll just spin down and have a look down here uh, what else can I show you I'll just do a u-turn and we'll finish up along this back lane there's some nice looking um, ovens and bits and pieces here so more compact ovens a couple of no heaps of 900s actually some nice 900 uh, ovens there they're pretty nice still got a few of these KitchenAid dishwashers uh, it's got the integrated front on it uh, it's got the cutlery rack uh, they were about fourteen fifteen hundred dollars in the shops uh, of course you need to put the, the, the you get the matching front for it to match up with your kitchen about those mid three hundred dollar mark on those uh, lots more bits and pieces across the top here sort of nice compact uh, compacts and 900s uh, still got a couple of these built-in coffee machines I can't believe we've still got a couple of these uh, they are absolutely fantastic I've got one myself um, you're, you're well and truly into the high 2000s in any brand uh, let alone KitchenAid uh, and you'll be about $1600 on one of those in a box uh, with a warranty right now, folks to finish up I just want to go outside because we've loaded up a heap of ceramic tiles um, so I'm reckoning you're going to be looking anything between sort of one or two dollars a square meter and sort of six and seven dollars a square meter just um just depending on what they are but they're all they all should be documented now online so as you can see there is an absolute mountain of ceramic tiles uh, just check through the catalog and you can see a little bit of outdoor gear here as well a little bit of x high gear i can see there's some shower bases there as well uh, so check in your catalog and uh, you'll be able to see all uh, all of those items of course we've got the carpet auction video and the timber auction video as well so make sure you check those two out uh, before you finish up thanks folks we'll see you next week